Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Rad with Tarot and this is going to be Libra Sun, Libra Moon and Libra Rising weekly Tarot and Lenormand reading for September 17th to September 23rd 2018 <clears throat> and while I'm shuffling the cards um, just want you to acknowledge that this is a, a general reading for the star sign and for personal readings um, <clears throat> You can go to my website, which link you will find down below in the description of this video. And there you can, um, you will see, you know, a, a full list of my services as well as their pricings. And it is a, a summer end sale going on. That means that a 10 minutes will be added on the 30 minute um, service. So becoming total of 40 minutes. So that being said, going to the tarot reading first. Now, uh, the this is going to be a four card spread. The first card here is about the topic of your week, Libras. The second card regards to the uh, core of the situation. The third card is about the challenges that you have to overcome for the duration of the week. And the last card is about the guidance that tarot has to offer to you. So let's see what kind of a topic you do have here. We have the Hermit card for you. So the topic is quite significant. You can expect a, a major either a solution, decision or, or direction into your life to be given in a, for the duration of this week. Now, um, the, the Hermit card is a card of a, a process. So the results may not follow in this particular week, but rather establishing your new direction, it is what is going to take place for the uh, uh, from September 17th to September 23rd, 2018. Because the Hermit is more associated with um, the realization what kind of a shape your life needs to obtain and how to how to follow or how to achieve such a shape of your life rather than achieving the shape of your life in general uh, that that achievement will happen in a prolonged period of time going into the future but this week most likely you are going to start questioning your emotions you are going to start questioning your positions as well regarding your family regarding your relationship regarding your career as well and um, it is likely that many of you or the majority of you of course are going to reach to a conclusion that uh, you know they have to make certain changes in their lives despite of what other wants from them or despite you know of what the situation is uh, at this very moment and uh, <clears throat> that will happen through a withdrawal and under withdrawal I mean that most likely you will stop acknowledging what our people wants from you but the more important thing will become of what you want from yourself from your life you know for your children for example from your relationship and from career from your career that itself is going to create a, a huge impulse which is going to give you the means necessary for you to um, focus yourself more upon your your life and the wholeness of your life what I mean is that what your life involves um, rather than focusing on the um, comfort of exterior lives of, for that matter of, uh, of your friends you know uh, your boss at work etc etc so a, a very broad card as you can see it could manifest in in, in many ways but what is certain here is that this week is going to give you a, a something meaningful for you to live for and to work for. <clears throat> and the core of the situation of that or why this is happening is the Two of Cups. And that could very well signify your new love. So your new love gives new meaning to your life and new direction, you know. Because until this very moment, just to give you an example, until this very moment, uh, you thought that you will be single and you will never find love. And you have oriented your life to revolve around that. But now as you have found a new love and it is a sincere one, now this, re uh, this 
revolution around being single will no longer be uh, accurate so you have to twist that revolution around being in love with someone all right so a, a new direction more meaningful than the one that you are right now is going to present itself to you libra into this particular week the very least the two of cups points to a um, harmony because in the grand scheme of things, the Two of Cups uh, signifies for career, for example, I, um, <clears throat> a harmonious interactions and relationships with your co-workers, with the projects as well, with your boss and with your supervisor. So it's kind of like more comfortable and pleasant environment that you are going to experience at your working place. And also it does symbolize sharing, right? Sharing the good and the bad fortune with these people. Same goes for a relationship. And therefore this card points that shyness is something highly unadvisable for the duration of this week. Because um, only if you ask, then you will have the answer. If you don't ask, the answer always will be no. So basically, uh, you have to overcome your shyness. You have to overcome your, I cannot say dignity, but pride. All right, you have to overcome your pride. And if you want something uh, to happen in your life, you know, something out of the ordinary that is going on right now, uh, then you have to ask for it and, uh, and furthermore put the toils behind it so it could take a certain shape. And then we have the challenges here now. We have the Nine of Swords and maybe you will find yourself afraid from the consequences of what will happen, you know, after you uh, kind of embark this new meaningful direction of your life, most likely attached to the life purpose as well. So that could... Um, that could manifest through that you need to kind of detach from, I don't know, you know, a certain project, certain people, maybe your family, for example, you may realize here that you have to start living with the person you love rather than living with your family. And then this is going to, of course, uh, cause certain consequences of, the, of such a particular step that you have to face and you may find yourself afraid what will be uh, what will be the result of those consequences for example you will have to provide more for yourself since you will no longer live under the roof of your parents just saying an example <clears throat> you know or that could be that uh, you um, realize that you are no longer happy into your uh, career, into your work right now, and you use your connections that you do have here, the cumulative experience, to find a new job, and you are finding yourself a little bit afraid, what will be the consequences of you leaving the current job that you are working right now? It could manifest in many ways, but generally this card speaks that you may find yourself reluctant to do any steps because you will uh, have the fear of what kind of a negative impact and consequences this kind of a new direction will play as a role into your already current undertakings that are going on in this very moment. And the last card here points as a guidance. This is the Four of Swords. So uh, this card advise you <clears throat> not to share uh, your further plans. This card advise you first before you actually announce, you know, your revelations here that you have uh, reached through finding, you know, the new meaningful chapter of your life. Before you uh, reveal that in front of the world, it will be advisable for you to uh, ask for a counsel. Uh, that could as well again manifest itself in a many different way ways. Some of you may need the ca a counsel of um, financial advisor, for example, if this new direction of their life involves investing into a company or in a stock trades, etc., etc. It could um, involve itself, you know. Um, consulting yourself with psychotherapist, for example, or with. Um, with business consultant or with just a very faithful companion but what the point of the four of swords is that you need to find comfort into your intentions and that will not happen if you are yet afraid of the consequences of these very if the, of these um very same uh, same actions that you are thoroughly 
have to deliberate with these people. So it's kind of like um, as the guidance this card serves you to not be irrational, all right, and not to be very hasty, but rather uh, think three times before you act and uh, become more aware of what will be the true result of those actions because if people don't deliberate upon their intentions uh, most likely they kind of like over exaggerate the results in either way either negative or positive and this exaggeration could be the very well uh, the cause here of being afraid of what impact your actions which are focused upon the hermit card that signifies you know the new chapter of your life will have upon the current chapter that you are in right now so this was the tarot reading now let's see what the Lenormand reading has to say for you Libras and the Lenormand reading will um, show a event happening in this week that you should either look forward to or try to avoid All right let me cut and the first card is the bear so the bear is about uh, support and it's about uh, nourishing then we do have the child so that could affect a child or it could affect a new beginning it stands for two ways and then we do have the mice which could stand positive or in negative ways the mice could stand for a, a problems beneath the surface or the mice could stand as well for fertility and especially those who are trying to get pregnant now I do believe that this is the week where you become pregnant and if that doesn't give you a new purpose for life I don't know what does alright or it could be that um, you are going to uh, find out or you will be brought it will be brought to your attention that you are attending way too much to your child that you are spo spoiling your child all right or you it could be brought to your attention that you are worrying way too much for establishing a, a new beginning in your life which is pretty much the same thing here that you are worrying what will be the impact of starting a new chapter of your life what that new chapter will how that new chapter is going to impact the current chapter that you are in right now so that being said Libras this was your weekly tarot and Lenormand reading for September 17 to September 23rd and again acknowledge that this is a general reading for your star sign this is not your personal reading and if you want a personal reading um, you, everything that you need to know that is my website which link you can find down below in the description of this video and there you will find a full list of my services as well as their pricings Rod signing out now see you next time bye